Bean Blossom, Indiana, June 13th, 1978, evening set. Just like we've heard some great music, the greatest is here now. With all his bluegrass boys, he's back home in Indiana. Make him glad he's back. Here's Bill Monroe. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Right, right on. Wake them, make them, wake them. All right, the Bluegrass Boys are glad to be here for the last show tonight. And we're going to be here a long time, and I hope that you can stand it and stay with us. On the left-hand side, you know, is Wayne Lewis, and the next fellow in line is uh, Randy Davis. And on the right-hand side, the Butch Robbins and Kenny Baker. Give them all a hand, please. All right, now we're going to call on uh, Wayneford Lewis here. And uh, truck driving man, he used to be a truck driver, and he never got over that number. I was gone. I got those trucks to the road. 
for I'm on my way to San Now, Butch is getting tuned up over here, and we're going to call on him to do a good banjo number for you folks tonight. And he knows so many banjo numbers, I don't know what he's really got picked out for here tonight. Cross New Cumberland. Butch, that was fine, and you coming right along with that number. That's a hard number to do, though, you know it? I know that. You ain't kidding, boy. Crossing the Cumberland. That was back in the days when they was driving the mules and the horses, and then they broke down on this Cumberland Mountain, and they had to spend the night there, and they didn't know where the Indians was at, you see. All right, now I have some solos I'd like to do for you. An old Texas number entitled Goodbye, Old Pal. Pain 
horse, now he's gone to rest. Honey, milk, and he's that man in Texas, the way out west. Where the kangaroo blood tore his grave and the coyotes cry. I know he sleeps in perfect peace beneath the Texas sky. Howdy, yeah, 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 yeah. Kevin and Caroline, let me try that. I don't know how good it'd be. Thank you a lot. Now I have a little mountain number I want to do for you here tonight. And uh, it's uh, really a, an old time sound. It's a uh, wrote off of a number Mark or Penn played. And the number he played was entitled Sleepy John. This number is entitled Get Up John. And one of the high uh, country boys wanted me to do this number. And he's even loaned me his mountain so it'll sound better and everything. So uh, with the, I want to do the number entitled Get Up John. Get me the mountain, boys. Wayne's getting slower by the day. He's been sick. Yeah, yeah. I want to get my man back. Thank you. 
thank you. Thank you a lot for letting me play the man, and it sounds all right. And the tune of Get Up John. Blue Moon. Okay, let's see now. Uh, it's right time for the quartet to sing, and then Kenny Baker's going to fiddle for you. So uh, you boys gang around here now. Butch Robin, get over here. Randy Davis and Wayne. What, what's it going to be this time? Precious memory, I'd like to hear you lead that. You do a wonderful job that. I'll give you, I'll give you credit for that. Thank you a lot. Thank you a lot. 
Okay, he's getting ready. He's getting his fingers warmed up for a number that he wrote a couple, three years back. Yep. And this is a fine number now. And he has this recorded. And he does a wonderful job with it. He used his own arrangements on it and everything. A note for note boy. <laughs> and it's a number that the people all over the country love him today. And he's been featured on the Grand Ole Opry. I don't think it's a, a fiddle number anybody plays could get around it. Now, it's called Jerusalem Ridge. I wrote that number, Bill. <laughs> Thank you, <my> kid. <laughs> See, uh, Butch, who's coming in to play tomorrow and sing some new ones? We're having a band contest tomorrow. That, well, your first thing, you're having the Bluegrass Band Contest, and they need to register in around 10 o'clock, don't they? Yes, sir. And uh, we'll have some good judges, and uh, there are always a lot of uh, Bluegrass bands here on, uh, on Wednesday. Tomorrow's Wednesday, is that right? Yes, sir. Wednesday. All right. And uh, so we want to, that'll be uh, a lot of fun and a lot of enjoyment, and they'll be having different ideas about the music and different tones, and I, I want to listen to it. And then, uh, following that, there'll be some uh, bluegrass music take over along up in the evening. And some of the groups that's coming in, I believe, is the Brock Brothers. Is that right? Thanks, sir. Brock Brothers. And they have uh, three of the brothers, and their sister comes along. And, uh, and then uh, uh, Johnny Lee uh, Baker is going to be here with his group. They're coming in. And uh, what's the name of their group, Kenny? Uh, let me see. It's Dry Branch Fire Squad. Dry Branch Fire <laughs> Squad. What do you think about that? And he's a, he is a Kenny Baker's son, and he's a fine boy. And, uh, and they've got a wonderful group, and they've got some fine singing. They've got a duet there that's really wonderful to listen to. So uh, we're going to have uh, some more entertainers coming in here tomorrow. And I uh, see that uh, the Randolph family, they're here, and we might talk to them and know if we can get up on stage. And this old man from London, England, we might get him up here. Uh, he's, uh, he wants to sing. He really loves to show off for it. I didn't know they was that like that over in England, but they are. He made a salad up here tonight for some people, and he ain't nothing to do but he ate some. I had to eat some of it, and I haven't felt right since. <laughs> In the meantime, I got my hat stole up there at the Peebles, Jim Peebles' house, 
and he had to let me have his hat. This is his hat. Some real old lady boy got my hat and just right out there. <laughs> and I haven't seen it since. Huh? Boy, you keep, keep, keep your hats on your head here in Bean Blossom. Okay, now, request, please. Tall Pines, can you sing that? That is the number you know that James and me sung, and we, he's going to be back in here Saturday and Sunday, so we'll be doing numbers like that for you. Nine pound hammer, yes. Done that in a long time, man. Eh? Anyway, we're not trying to do comedy for you to make you laugh. <laughs> <laughs>
promise that she would always love me. Me. Look, I, I didn't. I, 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 I thought I'd seen you before. I don't. Well, well, I've got something to say to you. you you've been. He's been on at me all day long. He don't like the way I speak. He don't like my food. He don't like it. I'm gonna go and work with Jimmy Martin. You keep on. <laughs> I'll tell you. I, now I'm gonna tell you something else. Now you may not know this. This this is a secret. Now I've kept this secret for a long time. Do you know what they say about the Monroes in Scotland? They was horse thieves. <laughs> yeah. They're still thieves, that, They too. must be wrong, because he only keeps mules. <laughs> you don't know Birch, though. <laughs> Birch, you... <laughs> Birch been stealing horses Birch well. can pick up anything he can get his hand on. I've seen him after a lot of women. <laughs> Bill? I really, I, I'm enjoying this festival. It's, it's really fine, and you're in, you're in good form tonight, man. You, you're really showing them how to play that mandolin. Well, and, thank you, thank you. And any time you need a job, you can come and work I appreciate me. you coming on the stage. <laughs> <laughs> His name is Doug McHattie from London, England. He deserves a nice hand, too. And by the way, you've only got one more number. <laughs> <laughs> he said he was proud I just had one more number. Randy says he's running a show and said we could sing on and on and now. And the announcer said we better get off stage. White House Blues, yes, sir. The White House Blues. Yeah.
cabin home on the hill.
Could you leave it alone, please? Keep you're making him loud, and you don't, you're cutting me and Kenny down. And that's not fair to the public here. I'm right after him, boy. He can't kid me. His face is getting redder by the minute there, too. Yeah, I'll run them both out of here. Let's see, we've had a request for the Walls of Time, and I haven't sung that in a long time, and, and, uh, but we will try it for you. And uh, uh, Randy Davis is going to lead this number. We're going to call on Butch Robin for another good banjo number here. And what do you got this time, Butcher? Did you tell the folks who uh, uh, the man I belonged to that I played back here? Can't you remember nothing? Butch, oh. Butch Waller. Right. Not Butch Robin. Butch Waller with uh, High Country. It belongs to him. And I appreciate that a lot. What are you going to do this time? Uh, dear, old dear Old Dixie. That's a good one.
All right, thank you, Butch. Now we're going to call on Kenny Baker, and he's going to fiddle another one for you. I want to say it's really a pleasure to be here with you folks tonight, and I hope you've enjoyed the festival that's gone along. And the Bluegrass Band Contest will get underway tomorrow, and they'll start registering in around 10 o'clock in the morning. I want to thank you for buying the Bluegrass albums here tonight. We appreciate that a lot. And James and me have the new one out that come out the 7th of June, and it's back together again, the title of it, and we'd like you to have it. Kenny's got his album, and Butch's got uh, albums with him, too. What's going to be? White well, Horse I'm going to do that other number I wrote, that White Horse Breakdown. Okay, I'd like to hear you do it. <laughs> Bluegrass boys, everybody.